testosterone doesn't make you aggressive. Here's what it actually does. Take five male rhesus monkeys, put them in a group, let them form a dominance hierarchy. A defeats B three times. B never defeats A. This is the hierarchy. Now take C and inject C with testosterone. Give C like so much testosterone, like every amygdaloid neuron is growing antlers and that guy just enormous. So now does C get involved in more fights? Absolutely. Is this the pattern that occurs now? Is C suddenly challenging A and B and rising in the heart? Absolutely not. C never does a thing with A and B. What happens instead is C becomes a total nightmare to D and E. <laughs> Testosterone does not invent aggression. Testosterone exaggerates pre-existing social patterns of aggression. What testosterone really does is when your status is being challenged, testosterone makes you do whatever you need to do to maintain status. You can have an economic game where people get status by making generous offers and give people testosterone and they become more generous in the game. In other words, if you shot up a whole bunch of Buddhist monks with testosterone, they would run amok doing random acts of kindness all over the place. The trouble isn't that testosterone makes us aggressive. The trouble is that we reward aggression with status arrest.